The armed forces act 2004 is the existing legal framework that guides and regulate the conduct and activities of the Nigerian military. Well, the laws from which the armed forces of Nigeria copied her own laws has undergone several reviews reflective of the ever-changing status of the world, ours has remained stagnant, regardless of the dynamics of the change in society. Some of the areas of the law to be addressed by the proposed amendment include command influence in the composition and administration of military justice system, conformity with convention of the International Labour Organization, ILO. I urge you to consider amendment to the Armed Forces Act that we accord statutory entitlement to members of the Armed Forces of Nigeria that are killed or wounded in action. Meanwhile, the Nigerian Army has inaugurated an information call center towards meeting the objective of securing the nation, increased interface between security agencies and the public. We will receive whatever that affects us and treat them accordingly. We will monitor and go along with the civil police or to such a point that will be required. Accessible from all the GSM network service providers, the center is with the short code 193. Information through call centers is an important area of e-governance. They provide avenues for citizens and other interested parties to seek and share information of government services around the clock. This, the Army noted, will provide real-time information for proactive security operations nationwide. From the Nigerian Army headquarters in Abuja, Ismail Musa, NTA News.